this is a story that's sure to inspire. Playing with Heart is a new documentary that follows the Poway Padres Special Olympic softball season and their quest for a three-peat championship. It's set to debut next week. Joining me right now is director Brian Jenkins, head coach Tony Rubino, and Barry Cunningham, who plays on the team. Gentlemen, thank you for being with me today. I want, I want to start off with Tony, uh, Coach Tony, asking you if you could talk about what the Poway Padres are and what motivates you to be a part of this program year in, year out. Thanks for having us. Uh, we started about 23 years ago with 12 players, and we're up to about 60 and the fun part for me and the other coaches is just seeing each the play each year. They love to play the game, and they uh, listen, learn, and it, I just see it helping build their confidence over the years and helping them just grow as individuals. So it's been a fun, uh, journey, and uh, many kids go, but uh, we have a group of families and players that's just fun to be around. One of those players, Barry, right next to you. Uh, uh, Barry, I want to ask you, what does it mean to you to be a part of this team, to be a Padre, uh, a Poway Padre? How important is that to you? It's very important that um, us as a Poway Padres are as a family and that we play together, we win together, we, we lose together, and when we lose and when we win, it, it's just fun because we get to play the game that we love. I, mean, I love uh, softball a lot. I mean, when I first started playing, it was it was kind of new, but I started getting the hang of it. It started growing, and now I bat first for the Power Padres, and I love I love playing the game, and it's just really fun. Barry, it sounds like it's a big part of your life. Can you tell me what what's the best part of being a Poway Padre to you? What's the absolute tops? I don't know if there's a lot. Um, just playing with the team and just enjoying the time and practicing and getting better and all the coaches and they, the coaches just work on how we can get better. And every time we go on the field or a tournament, we just show off and everyone will talk about us like, what are the Poway Padres doing here? They beat us last game. Let's see if we can beat them this game, but we end up winning so it's it's really fun i mean i don't care if i win or lose i just like playing the game that's all that matters to me it, it is a fantastic story and so we need a good storyteller step in brian jenkins he's a filmmaker uh you you made a documentary here how did you hear about the Pow poway padres and why did you decide to make this film yeah so uh coach tony got in touch with me i believe it was at the end of the 2018 season and I think they just come off this like historic season. They, you know, they've won the championship. And, you know, I think he thought it'd be really great to to document this story. And, you know, he when he first called me, it was there was just so much passion and excitement that I was just like, okay, I love baseball. And if you know there's somebody out here that's this excited about this story, I gotta find out more. So you found out more. What did you learn here? Did you learn things? I, I've got to imagine this experience informs you as a human being, as a person, but you had to learn stuff as a filmmaker and telling stories as well, didn't you? Oh, for sure. I mean, I think my approach from the beginning was to just kind of be a fly on the wall and, and document this season. And I think in the end, you know, I, I took away a lot and learned a lot, but I think my biggest takeaway was just, you know, how this team, you know, really lives in the moment and they, and they just love, being together and like, you know, I win or lose, you know, they're a team, but I think also, you know, they were very competitive and that was really exciting, exciting to watch. You know, they went out to try winning every game, but uh, you know, they just did it. They played with heart and yeah, I guess I'm, I'm, I'm kind of at a, a loss for words. <laughs> Well, I'm going to step back over to Coach Tony, and I'm just going to ask him, you've been a part of this a long time. You are a part of the story. Uh, I, I assume that you've seen the movie at this point. What does it mean to you to have this made, and what were you thinking watching it play out? Well, when, like Brian said, we had come off this historic season, and we went out of town for the first time, and these guys just played their hearts out. And I'm coming home with my in-and-out chocolate shake thinking, <laughs> what did I just experience? And I got to share this with other people. And that's when I got a hold of Brian. And he, he definitely has shown the passion that these young men play with, the joy they get, 
they show up to play and practice with heart. And whether we win or lose, we're okay. But uh, yes, he, he got, I think, I wanted to share what I've experienced with other people in the community, and I think he did a heck of a job. All right. Uh, Barry, I'm almost out of time here, but I want to ask you, Barry, how cool is it to be in that movie? Did you and your team teammates just love this? Yeah, I mean, I the, this, uh, this movie is going to be amazing just to give hope to people, uh, little kids who want to go play in the MLB or just to go play – play their favorite sport. I mean, this is a hope for people just around the world that know that people with disabilities and that know how to play softball, know how to how to play with heart and know how to go and take pride in what they do and make them happy. And like, that's, that's what playing with heart means to me. It's just going out there and showing my best and giving it 100% at the end of the game, win or lose. That's fantastic. Playing with Heart is going to premiere Friday, July 23rd at Maranatha Chapel. Filmmaker Brian Jenkins, head coach Tony Rubino, and player Barry Cunningham, thank you so much for your time and best of luck with this film and with all your future games, Barry and Tony. Thank Thanks you so much. Thank you.